Sometimes CDs are better than bonds. That's next. A certificate of deposit offers a higher interest rate than a money market fund or a bank savings account, but you don't have access to your money for a period of time without paying an early withdrawal fee. CDs offered by a bank or credit union are simple interest-only bonds that are sometimes very attractive. The highest paying CDs have higher yields than treasury bonds and give the small investor a rare advantage over conventional bonds and brokered CDs. For instance, today the annual yield on a five-year treasury note is about 1.5%, but in contrast the yield for a CD with equivalent term and risk varies from a high of 3% to nearly zero. Wow, that's quite a range, isn't it? CDs are like bonds in that they provide fixed monthly payments but cannot guarantee the full return of principal before the end of the term. The amount of the early withdrawal fee is limited, commonly 3 to 12 months of interest, depending on the bank or credit union. While that's generally true, look at this. This credit union offers an exception for CDs and IRA accounts if you are over some age. I don't mention this to advertise this credit union, but rather to emphasize the point that while bond market is incredibly efficient, CD market is not, and that creates some attractive opportunities for individual investors. Now it's time for some fun. I'll give you two facts. You choose the fact that's true. Here's one. Sometimes CDs are better investments than bonds. Here's the other. Large institutional investors invest in CDs. This is false. CDs are issued to individuals by banks or credit unions and insured by these federal agencies. So CDs, like U.S. Treasury bonds, have essentially zero credit risk, but the FDIC or NCUA insurance levels are limited to amounts that make these CDs attractive to individuals, but inappropriate for large institutional investors. This is true. Keep in mind that bank CDs aren't negotiable, meaning you can't sell them in any market. To redeem them, you must go back to the bank or credit union where you purchased it. As I have showed, sometimes CDs are offered at above market interest rates with low early withdrawal fees. If you can lock in a CD with a higher rate than the equivalent treasury bond, then obviously you come out ahead for no additional credit risk. If interest rates go up, it can be even better, which I'll show you next with a simple example. Here you buy both a 4% CD and a 4% note. Towards the end of the first year, interest rates increase to 5%, and you'd like to replace them to take advantage of the new higher interest rates. To sell your CD, you'd have to pay an early withdrawal penalty, which we'll say is three months interest for our example. Our annual interest rate divided by 12 is the interest rate per month, which we'll multiply by three months to get the early withdrawal penalty. Note that it remains 1% of the amount of the CD for any day after that until the CD matures. But an ordinary bond is different. There is no early withdrawal penalty, but its price changes every time the interest rate changes. And the amount of the price change gets smaller as the bond approaches maturity, or more precisely, as the bond duration approaches zero. Now remember, we bought this bond one year ago, so there are now four years left on this bond. For now, we'll say that the duration is also equal to four years. A bond price always changes in the opposite direction as interest rates by an amount equal to the rate change times the duration. So our simple estimate is that the cost to refinance the bond is four times more than the CD, which is our point. Sometimes CDs are better than bonds. Again, you're not going to get rich with bonds, but bonds are a critical element for controlling the risk in any portfolio, so it's vital that you understand the basics about how they work. Now, if you understand about how CDs work, then you are well on your way to understanding how other bonds work. That's next. Please give us a thumbs up if this video was helpful to you, and to subscribe to our channel, click here. Thanks for watching.